We are done and never have ever felt more <laughs> knackered as well as satisfied at anything I've ever done in my life. But I'm ready for it to be over now. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to just go home now, to be honest. <laughs> Um, feeling pretty tired, feeling pretty stiff, but it's starting to get a bit rainy as well. Um, but otherwise, feeling refueled, feeling a bit more energised, and hopefully, the thought of my grandfather and all the monies we're going to be racing, um, raising will push me on through it. And that's what that's what I'm most excited about, and most looking forward to at the end of the day. So, just got to keep doing it until eventually the, the deed is done. So, might as well just chop, chop, and get on with it, right? I'm really looking forward to just no longer cycling. You haven't even started day two. Mm, that's right. And I'm already looking forward to not being on day two either. <laughs> he said, he distinctly said it was less climbing. No, no, no one said that. I'm not gonna lie, it's really impressively miserable. <laughs> Come on, 25 kilometers to end up like, Ooh, south of where we started. Let me sh I'll show you later what happened. Can how long, how long are you gonna say dual? How long are you gonna say dual carriageway? We, we were going we south. We're going to John O'Groats. <laughs> There wasn't that many roads down there. So it's half past one now. By the time we're ready, it's going to be two. I think we'll do this in about seven hours with a, with a half hour stop. Awesome. I think about six hours cycling. So 9.30. We, last time we got back at like to fit quarter to 11, so yeah. that's much better than last it, it time. Should, it, we'll need rear lights, but it should still be light enough to see. <laughs> Sign for Cheltenham. What do we say about that, boys? It's been a brutal day. What have you got for me? Oh, Nothing after that climb. Quite moist. Still quite Here he is. My gusset's actually quite dry, but. Here he is. Come on, machine. Oh, yeah, I can't for himself. I'm not sure if the baby was. I'm treating myself to a massive bowl of. Chili and rice before we take on for day three. Plenty of energy and it's delicious and should hold me out till the first rest stop at 50k. If you think how many miles we've done, it's like how like collectively it hasn't been a single pump. Yeah. It's because we're pumping our tires. Yeah. Obviously if we go over glass all forms, you can't yeah. think about that. But, uh, How are you feeling tonight? Yeah, good. A bit late. Um, a lot later than I was hoping we'd be at this time, but um, at least we had a nice lunch.
today, oranges. the miles to go was going downwards. Oh. Today we were going in the right oh. direction. Today, the <laughs> that now turned oh, no, itself off, so it's wasted. Now we're going to do it all over again. What happened? Um, well, just car, I don't really know, it all happened just so quickly. Just car swerved in and he slammed on the brakes and I slammed into the back of him. And then I slammed into the floor and everything slammed together and then one slam after another I just was on the ground and so my wrist is a bit stiff but otherwise mm -hmm. I'm fine. How long left? 60k? About 60k, like yeah. About 60k. Another two and a half hours to three hours. Oh, don't say that. Unfortunately, it's got to be said. <laughs> It was good. I mean, today was definitely the best day. I think everyone rode really well. Jack rode really, really well. Um, Bishy did. You know, cli Bishy climbed well. Day four. This is where it really counts. The training is what we've been building up to. No, that didn't work. <laughs> Day four, feeling a bit tough in the legs, but today's one of the most difficult days and it's gonna feel satisfying to get out of the way, so let's just get on and do it. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Right, where did we even leave this morning? I can't even remember where we started. It's, it's dead to us. Like there was, I was yeah. born and then I was on a bike. <laughs> I can. I'm not sure I can. Of course you can. I'm not sure I can. Well, you, it's easy. You do as much as you can until you can't, and then you get in the car. And then you do. You get in the car. I don't want to be back. I don't want to go to sleep at 1.30. Then get in the car. <laughs> get in the car and go to sleep now. Oh, I love that so much. Imagine how warm it is. I'm so tired. Lovely. <laughs> I have like three days behind on sleep. Yeah, you do. Feeling very tired now, and just wish that we weren't cycling anymore, ever. But the most important thing is what we're doing yeah. it for. For charities, sure. and that's what's important. Right, call it, Rum. We're on holiday. Two hundred K in the bag. Boy, dig up. And this tiny, this tiny little green bear. They take me there. feeling Jack? I'm feeling fine. Feeling good. Yeah. Just that that was just like my second wind came as soon as I saw that incredible view. Just phenomenal. Truly phenomenal. I don't feel too bad today. I don't. You know the legs hurt first thing in the mornings because you just got so many miles in them but um, yeah I don't feel too bad. I think I grow into these things I think day one's always the worst for me because I'm not cycling anywhere near as much as someone like, like Ian, for example. You know, he does it big rides kind of just as part of his cycling routine, but 
once you grow into it and you think, oh, I can do 200K and I won't fall over, you probably just get used to it and you're like, well, come on, then, let's do this. Scotland, a massive milestone. Haven't seen any immediate differences apart from sign names, but otherwise, let's feel in terms of morale boost, that's certainly good because uh, that means we're pretty close now. Um, so, yeah, um, got another what 170 left to get through until the end of this leg, and then only two more, which is pretty big. So, yeah, that's all very positive. <laughs> Glass in the front, I can see glass in the back as well. So here we are. Day six, it's in Loch Lomond. Um, feeling pretty tired now. It gets rougher and rougher every day, taking a greater and greater toll with every morning. But I think by day four, I'd slowly adjusted and I'm more of just like compelling to the, well, not compelling, but like I'm sort of just adjusting to the pain and it's sort of like I'm just learning to deal with it better as well. Um, and with this newfound coping, um, we're slowly pushing forward, which is, as I've said many times, what it's all about. Um, and I'm hoping we're going to be able to do this um, in the time that we in, in the time that we um, we were planning to. Um, but only two days left, which is really really positive. So let's go out there and get get it. Still curry. Damn it! It's another long one, 130 miles, 210 kilometers. A lot of climbing. We were putting a few extra hills for Bish. He loves it. Some tunes, and it just made all the difference. And the sun came out a little bit, and no, it didn't. No, it didn't. yeah, yeah, because all that excuses what I just saw. <laughs> it was just, it was just a little 10k of non misery. I mean, I'm not going to go so far as to say euphoria, but it was a little 10k of no bloody hills where you could just pedal, listen to some music, and just go loopy and listen to Cass talking Scottish to people on the way through. Just little moments like this make this absolute ball busting calamity worth it. I'm always reminded of Nemo and Dory. He goes, I don't want anything to happen to him. Well, that's kind of weird. If nothing ever happens to him, well, what's going to happen to him? You know, you've got to, you know, I don't want to say be careful because you're 16, but I just think if you come off at 50, 60, 60 mm. kilometers an hour. Mm. <laughs> there was one point where you were close. I was, I was so close, pushing, 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 pushing. 220 in the legs. I was just fingers crossed for any uphill, any uphill will screw him. Just a <laughs> tiny bit. And it was a bridge. It was the bridge, bridge. right here. Uh, it was the bridge. Uh, 
Wow. Yes, I would like to end that ride now. I'd like to not be riding. Resources. Don't use Mobile resources. 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 Mob